Maranatha, to my PBC family and friends. Pastor Brian here with another quick bite, living the word. Today our words should come from uh, 2 Thessalonians chapter 3. As Paul's bringing this book to a close, he has these words to say to the church at Thessalonica. And I wanted to share this with us this morning because it just kind of stood out to me, um, just something in here that I just, I think is so important for us to remember in this time. It says, finally, brethren, pray for us that the word of the Lord may have free course and be glorified even as it is with you. And that we may be able to deliver that, that we may be delivered from the unreasonable and wicked men, for all men have not faith. Now I want to pause here for one second. Okay, who is he talking about? Right? Well, why would he bring up all men have not faith? Well, here's the point. We already know that not everybody believes in Jesus Christ. We already know that not everybody trusts in Jesus Christ, their Lord and Savior. So why would he bring this up to them like uh, some sort of surprise to them? Like, oh, you understand, not everybody's believer, not everybody's saved. Well, we understand that. They understood that. So who is he talking about here? Well, honestly, he's talking about those delivered from the unreasonable and wicked men, for lack of better terms, that have crept into the house, that have come into the church. Those who are unreasonable and wicked that are amongst us. Why? Because not all of them have faith. Now, what, I want to be careful here. I'm not sitting here saying, sit there and look at everybody in the church and start judging them. I'm not saying that at all, guys. But what I'm telling you is this. It's just because you go to church with somebody doesn't mean that that person is all is, is really the Lord's. Just because somebody's at church doesn't mean that everything they say necessarily makes them Jesus's. All right? We have other evidences and things like that we can look into for those lives. But the point of the matter is that what I'm trying to say to you guys is very simple. That because there's not some of faith, here, listen to what he has to say next in verse 3. But the Lord is faithful, who shall establish you and keep you from evil. And we have confidence in the Lord touching you, that you both do and will do the things which we command you. So what does he actually, now he goes on to say, he says, here's the deal. Even though you may run into some faithless people in the church, people who want to just act like the, the world's coming in, we've got to have every answer, we've got to be ready to fight, we've got to be ready to do whatever the case may be. Even though you may run into some of those people in the church, here's the point. They may not be of the faith, but God, the Lord, is faithful. And he shall establish you, meaning to make you strong, settle you down, and keep you from evil. Trust in the Lord. Here's the point. Men may fail you. That's the truth. I'll fail you. Guys, I'm sure at some point, and, and if I haven't done it already, then that's a surprise in and of itself. But at some point, I'll fail you. At some point, your parents will fail you. At some point, your best friend will fail you. Sometimes your spouse will fail you. But God will never fail you. That's the point. He remains faithful even when we're faithless. Our God so wants to establish us with that heart. But here's the point. You have to build your faith on the Lord Jesus Christ, on him and his word, not on men. I know men can be a help. I know they can be a blessing. But you've got to make sure that you're building it upon him and him only. So that no matter who creeps in, no matter what they may try to do in swaying us, no matter how wicked they may actually be, that we can know these unreasonable, wicked people when we see them. Why? Because we're established in the faith. We don't need their faith to establish us. So I hope this encourages you today and challenges you. I love you. We love you. God loves you. And God's got this.